get back to the number plate, sorry. Yep. Back out. Saturday. This time. We've come to the tiny village of Scotland. Again. When I say we, new face on the block, new kid on the block. Hello. Hi. This is Daniel. Who is my gay lover. And I've just decided to come <laughs> out just right now. <laughs> oh, <dear. laughs> you can't say that. <laughs> I can say anything. <laughs> Done now. Yeah, you're out. Oh, dear. Actually, he's my nephew. Sorry, man. So we'll just leave that one there. <laughs> he's my nephew who I used to babysit, believe it or not. Oh, God, I feel old now. <laughs> but uh, yeah, first time while camping with my nephew. Should be a laugh, eh? He likes his craft beers. So well, that's one thing. The only reason he's here is he brought free beer. <laughs> All right, we'll just uh, negotiate this path. We've got no idea where we're going here. Nowhere I want to be, but I've never been this way before. That's it. the world <laughs> rugged isn't it so we're thinking it might go up there we're gonna have a walk up see how it's windy it is if not we'll stop down here she brought with swoon trunks She brought her costumes, got in. Nice and deep here, you know, you could just wait out there and you're in swimming. in the picture because I'll edit this in with the other footage anyway so that's the stash so we've got transient 7.4 Northern Monk Jake head new while I'm shouting at strangers let's say 5.8 that's all right the one we can't talk about and was it a car or a cat this is the palindrome one again s43 local brewery check them out they do some mint beer, these really good S43. Soup, love the soup. Norse Star, this is Imperial Stout, 9.8%. These two are from Morrison's, four pound can. This one here is Hayes Outdoors, his latest patrons project. So if you're watching this, Hazy, I got your beer. John Peeler. All the rest of it. Oh, like, and Daniel's got session IPA. I mean, he's come out with a session, man. It's, <laughs> it's never coming again. Pressure drop, bit of soup, see, soup's popular. And then the two on the end. The new while I'm gonna try that, like. 
Oh, but we're just waiting until the people go and then we're going to set up. This is a good spot, this though. I don't know what the wind's going to be like on the microphone. It's a bit windy, isn't it? So we've set up eventually. It's got the wind, it's picked right up. It's mad. That's uh, good. Not bad. Not bad. So the difference difference between an 800 pound tent and how much was yours 15. 15 pound he's paid for this in fact he got it for free but I mean look at that how cozy is that what kind of mats that that looks nice and tight nice and uh black one yeah. black mat nice black one can't beat a black mat like yeah, the best we'll not talk about this bit though <laughs> oh i keep tripping over your garlands oh, i'm gonna have to watch that we can fix this you know we can get this stock done that's a design feature that's for aerodynamics that's so that's so it doesn't snap yeah it's already flat yeah all right but when you consider there's like an 800 pound difference, it doesn't make any sense, does it? <laughs> Anybody want to buy a tent? I'm going to sell it. I'm going to get one of these. Save myself a bloody fortune. It's all you need. Even this is bowing in here, you know. That, that wind's hitting that right on the side on. So it's pushing it in. And that's as bad as it's going to get. Uh, still not great, was it? Anyway, let's do a 360. Oh, that wind, the wind. The tent's there, right up on top of the perch. It's mint, mint. There's nobody around now. Seeing that, it is seven o'clock at night. Like, look at this. Ah, oh, look at that one. The blue lagoon. Remember the disco, the blue lagoon. They were big in the seventies, weren't they? <laughs> in their own minds. We well, were mint in the seventies. Mint. Oh. Long way down, isn't it? Quick though. See the way the rock splits. Mm. You want to hang on now, get a photograph of that. So we've come down um, to the bay. Let's see what we, see what we can see. Right down there, mate. What are them rocks that we're just looking at? Are you going in? It's <laughs> going in. It's going in. But bizarre sheep up there. I don't know if you can make them out. All stuck to the side of the cliff. I don't know how they do it? Hanging on like that. That's not. Uh, that's that's quite a steep cliff as well. Clever sheep, like. Nice here. Really should have went in for a dip, shouldn't we? Yeah, I didn't bring a towel. I know, I forgot my towel and uh, that's it, like. But the wind will dry off in no time. <laughs> We're very trusting, aren't we, leaving all the gear up there? I'd only lose 15 pounds. <laughs> <laughs> Beers are worth more. <laughs> Did you find one? I got one. Nah. Ah. Just a rock. Oh, it's up here, aren't Aye, it's a bit there. It's a bit 
Do 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 There's another fish in there. If I can just cork it out. It's vanished. And there, look. Oh, that seaweed. Flitting about, it's gone. Where's it gone? That's a mystery. Periwinkles. Aren't periwinkles blue? Are they? I think so. Do you want a blank on me? No, we're not gonna we're not gonna have the crabs, we're gonna starve, that's what we're gonna do. Look at them. Boulder and masterclass. It's hard to tell if it's coming in or not, this. I'm going to have to strength. I'm in. Oh no. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm in again. Oh, what am I standing on? <laughs> no. Damn. Rock, it's like the I mean, slippiest rock in the world. Too old. I'll leave it to the nimble lads. He's like one of them sheep. So that was that's the easy way up. The non-slippy way. That was ridiculous that sliding on that rock. Right. Nah. It's not, the, lovely it's not the sort of terrain, is it, for the yeah. shelter? They probably are a bit further out. So we're not having lobster for tea. Just have to make do with crisps and vegan jerky. Which, to be fair, was quite nice. <laughs> I know, it was actually quite nice. Vegans make good jerky. They make good jerky, those do. So we'll leave the bear behind and we'll come back up. Get another beer, I think. It's got to be beer o'clock. Whoo! Bit of a hike up here. Tents are just there and you spot them. But we're just having a much before the sun goes down. It's gonna go up the top of there, see what's over the other side, and come back. Now this is St. Ab's lighthouse, and way off in the distance, you can't see it, there's a bass rock, Petticoat Wick, camped up there and there, and this is called. Maya Lock, Maya Lock. So we're gonna head back now because it's uh, getting starting to get dark. Uh, bait, get the bait on. It's good up here, like. Lush, isn't it? Really lush. Oh. Before we trip over things. This is on the hot pan. Super start. 
Look at the table up there. Not bad. It really doesn't. This is an excellent picture, this like. This is one of the best pictures for a while, this. Eh? Oh, let me get through it. Man. And I've got a bag of mushrooms as well that go in. And the expensive salt. <laughs> the garlic butter. Right, I've zipped up here because there's many, many creatures trying to get in. The wind's really dropped. It's good and it's bad. We're doing well with the wind because it was keeping all the creatures away. But, uh, Daniel's on the uh, palindromic cat. Oh, hold on, I'm not, I'm not picking it up. The bloody the headlights right in the way that uh, the can. How's that? Right, so shine of yours on the can. Was it a car or a cat I saw? I mentioned this in the last on the video I did. Up in the chief, it's palindromic lat. S43 Brewery. It's absolutely beautiful lot. If you like a hoppy beer, that's the one to go for. Like, full of hops. It's really Good. what a craft beer should taste like. I think. Nice and strong. Aye. Uh, oh, oh, this is an issue. This like, isn't it? Hang on. The, cam the, uh, the camera's it, blocking everything. Eh? I need a light, man. There you go. Aziz. How's that? More light. Transient. Sounds wrong, doesn't it? Here's it. This is another IPA, 7.4%. This is Morrison's beer, this. Oh, it's a double hop, that. No, the Monk's rep has been in Morrison's, hasn't he? Because there's loads. And there's the North Norse Star as well. Which is the Stout, Imperial Stout, 9%. Man. Four quid. All right. But yeah, I can highly recommend the um, S43 brewery stuff. This is a... Uh, brewery in Coxo. They're online. I'll put a link for this brewery in the description and give them a try because they do some excellent beers. I've had a, I've had a lot of them. Aye. So what we're doing is now whoosh, we're just chilling out, chill out with me crew. This is me crew. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Hello. And uh, there's a little bit of rain coming down, actually. A bit. It's not too bad. It's not so bad that we're getting in. So, hopefully it'll pass. No stars, unfortunately. No stars. That was, was that a bat? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Passed. No stars, no sunset. And uh, looking at the weather forecast for tomorrow, probably no sunrise. But you know, you never know. The weather's changing every five minutes, yeah. But that's it for the filming for tonight, so we'll see you in the morning for the Heidi High campus. Mint over there, like St. Abs over there. Morning campus, Heidi High, nothing. Nout. Nah. Nothing. Nothing. Nout. So we're just filming this. This is why I bring this camera. Because that's what that's what I'm filming. So in this, you can't really tell. Alright. It's alright. It rained through the night, but uh because it was windy it's dried the tent off. It was tent bone dry. Even though it rained, no condensation, which is good. And that's just so I'm gonna Get the kettle on. And then, I don't know, a slow pack. But there's things happening first. We will see. I think it'll vanish into the cloud. There's a big cloud bank there, so it might just be that. 
we'll see. There we go. All about the views. It's pretty nice, that. Worth getting up for. He literally put that rod in the water for 30 seconds. <laughs> so, this is where Daniel was. He uses the I Leave No Trace ethic. This is where I was. It's flat, that's it. That's where the beer cans were. So there's all that in my bag. Bagged up, tagged and bagged. And we've got to leave this lovely place now before all the tourists start arriving. We have had a little bit of lie in, like, didn't we? Nice relaxed, uh, It's like, I like that the tent went away bone dry. It's quarter to nine, like. We were up at six o'clock watching the sunrise. But yeah, everything's gone away dry and we've packed it all nice, so it's just a case of get home and just put it all away. No need to wash anything, dry anything, and all that rest of it. Had a good one then? Been great. Your maiden wild camp? Yeah, in great conditions, lovely sunrise, and great success all around. Great success! Happy day. <laughs> that cut my finger though, that's the only thing. Alright, so unless anything miraculous occurs, that's it, till the next one. Boosh. Boosh.